So often, it's easy to think that pop art emerged fully formed from the head, say, of Andy Warhol or Roy Lichtenstein. But the story of its emergence is much more complicated and, as a result, I think, much more exciting. For all its commercial appeal, pop art also belongs to a more cerebral tradition, pioneered by an artist who, in the 50s, had been all but forgotten. In 1917, Marcel Duchamp submitted a urinal to an annual exhibition, and in the process, he invented conceptual art. His mass-produced, ready-made sculptures declared that art could be governed not by painterly skill, but exclusively by the idea behind it. And in the 50s, young avant-garde artists were discovering him afresh.